Greetings and welcome back to King of Many Nations. In this episode, we will leave the Company of the Hat behind and move on to Mansa Samsu Kena of Mali. All right, this will be interesting because I have complained a lot about Mali never converting, and I will change this. And it, it's fun that we actually turned out to rule Mali from the very beginning. All right, our neighbors are Shia. So, in my humble opinion, Shia would be the way to go. The question is, do I have a concubine of the Shia faith? No, I do not. My Dresna is of the size 3. Let's see. Ooh, this guy. He is imprisoned by me. Alright. Then I should probably banish him. To be honest, I need to... Who do I have in my prison? It's only him. Alright. Uh, banish. Alright, lowering by 90. That's a lot. Perhaps I should just keep him in prison. Hmm. Um, I need land, though. I don't have much money, either. Well, the first thing we're going to try to do is to raid the Shias up here and hopefully find ourselves a Shia. A Shia wife, a concubine. Man, we can raise a lot of troops. 10,000. That's impressive. Alright, move up here. Do I have any factions by the way? No, no factions. We know any plots. Fabricate a claim on the Emirate of Mali. I, I don't no, I don't I do not approve. I'd rather like to revoke the shakedom of Gao from my brother. Yeah. Why not? I'm losing something. Alright, I'm losing the shakedom of Tagasa and Sarma, which means that I have to be quick about converting religion. That's the best thing about converting to Islam. You immediately gain Agnatic Open, I think. And it's a great inheritance law. One of the best. It's one of the very best. I do not have any mercenaries or something. No, good. I'm just losing a lot of money anyway. Having all of these troops. Mm, come on. Um, I could reform the West African faith, I guess. No, that would that would be way too much work. I I think I could do it, but not in three episodes. Let's, let's do that instead. Alright. Deceitful. I lost Honest as well. Not a big loss. Alright, so let's, let's raid here. Let's see. Is this stack large? Or small? Or it's just 500 men. Jihad for Maretziana. Uh, jihad against all the Kafirs in the Sultanate. Of... What? Oh, are they Sunni? Oh, it's the Arabian Empire, I think. What are they doing here? Hmm. Well, if I if I manage to get a Shia lady quickly, I mean, really darn quickly. Oh, I need to release him. If I ransom him, then I might be able to. Uh... Then war it is. All right, change of plans. I am ill. Not a good sign. Right, split this army in two. 
Actually, no. Let's go and wipe his main stack here. In Timbuktu. Yep, this is going to plan. I lost ill. Excellent. Fifty percent already. And uh, yeah, I'm losing gold. Uh, that was quick. Oh, it was Portugal. It was directed towards Portugal. I see. I thought it was against the Sunnis. Apparently not. Well, the Catholic Byzantine Empire is not stopping. I'm telling you that much. Holy War for Syria. Yeah, they are attacking the Arabian Empire now. Damn, the Byzantine Empire is scary. Alright, his capital is over there, so let's go and siege it. Should net us a nice amount of war score. And his army is decimated, so let's let's just siege. And I can't siege. Alright, well let's go and whack a mole. Play whack a mole with the little stacks here. I can siege this. Alright then, this works. Um, liberation of Jerusalem. Levantine Catholic. That's odd. So you're fighting the liberation and a holy war. This is worse than the crusades for them. The Byzantine Empire and France. Well, France isn't that big, but they are still a force to be reckoned with. Without a doubt. Uh, let's continue sieging this down. Oh, by the way, our dynasty name was... I always forget to check that the first episode. I noticed. Konare, or Konare. Mansa Samsu Kaina Kunare. Oh yeah, I forgot about this as well. Through diplomatic relations, sure. Yeah, let's keep. And the sieges are slow. Really, really slow. Well, let's take a look at the rest of the world. The Holy Roman Empire looks really nice. And Suomi has not gotten rid of this guy yet. Uh, right, I imprisoned my nephew. Sure thing. My grandson. I'll educate him. My primary heir, by the way. He's got rather nice stats. Comparatively. Oh, 100%. Alright, so now I have... Did I get it? Oh, yeah, I did. I did. I uh, can imprison my brother. Let me do this. Yes. Can I revoke stuff? He's a traitor. There we go. Uh, so now I hold it myself, which is fine. Go on a grand hunt, I guess. And then go raiding, as was originally planned. Roth, that's nice. Uh, 
I need to increase relations with all of my vassals if I'm planning to uh, convert. Because otherwise they will just revolt en masse. Huh? Well, I will not be blackmailed. What are they up to? Carry on for the vultures. Might have to hire some mercenaries for this. Oh yes, I, I do. Actually, I, I do need to hire some mercenaries. Um, we have one. The Ghanan Band. Right, gather them up. A great big stew. I have to waste most of my money to do this, but... Otherwise, I don't think I'll win. Now the win is guaranteed, and I, it also nets me a lot of new land, which is nice. Right, as soon... Oh! There we go. I'm still losing money, but not as much. I could even make sure to not reinforce my retinues. Then I'm earning money. Nice. Alright, split in... I actually need all of them. Uh, no, I can take this stack and go and hunt this one. That works. Um, yeah, sure. Humble. Excellent. Anything interesting happening here? No, not really. Defending against Easley invasion? Are they... They are Sunnis. Oh, the Shias. One so glorious. Alright, so the Caliph is winning the war against the Empire. Which is fine. That's fine. Otherwise, Byzantium might have gotten a bit too powerful for their own best. You steward. Money, please. I really need money. And I mean really need money. Fortunately, I'll be able I'll be able to get some. What? I don't even care about them. I'll siege this and then go and hunt them down. <clears throat> oh, even more! Another dangerous faction. Why? My steward. Um, they are probably going to declare, I think, so it might be right to just imprison him. Otherwise I have to fight, well, he, he's just a single duke, one county. Yeah, it, I, I don't know, really. Let's hope they don't declare. Ah, oh, they did. Well then. 94% That was what I was afraid of. All right, we will probably need to liberate money from Some rich dude somewhere otherwise we will be ousted um, Mayor uh, You Right, I know they hate me now, but still, the Ghanan band is ours to exploit. Even with it, we might not be powerful enough. But I hope so. Alright, if they are moving there, that's excellent. Nice. Oh, and they are reinforcing. Now we need to send these troops down here. 
Otherwise, things might end badly for us. Or, or not. Who knew? Alright, you stay. New Grand Vizier. Well, why not? My spy master still likes me. That's nice. Um, actually, I'm surprised that these people still like me at all. Man, I just imprisoned and banished an innocent mayor. Alright, well, they have zero coordination, it seems. So let's exploit that. They are not sending this 7,000 stack up here to merge with this two or 3,000 stack. Which means that we will be able to wipe them out in peace. Also gain a lot of land well, while we imprison these guys. 100%. Yep, and there's going to be a mass revoke of your stuff. No one of you have any money, right? Emirate of Songhai. It's mine now. Give me that. Give me everything. Um. Oh, okay. My vessel. Revoke. Oh, him as well. Marijata. Wati. And you. Whoever you are. Alright. And let's get rid of the city holdings. Sultanate of Mauritiana? What the hell? Why do they have a holding randomly? Right, so we hold two holdings too much. Um, we should probably give away Songhai to someone who likes us. Not that guy. Do we have anyone in our court who likes us? Nope. Then we go for a noble. You are not good enough. No ambitious nobles. Yeah, I can do better. Sure. Good enough. Good enough. You can have Songhai. Right. Merge. Oh, this stack disappeared. I had no idea. Oh, they are beat. No? Hmm. Alright then. Odd. They almost managed to defeat the Ghanan band, but they didn't. Uh, new steward. Uh, you are fine. Wait, 100%. And let's go on another revoking spree. Revoke Ghana. And uh, you... Or not you. Prisoned for zero years. Must be you. Okay, I can't revoke stuff from him. And, uh... Yeah. That must have been it. So, do we want to give something away? Probably. To Jor. Ghana. We we'll probably give Ghana away. Not to him, not to that guy. Well, it, it's the same guy, so not surprising. Magan. Excellent. Uh, not Timbuktu, Ghana. There you go. You can have it. And this is Timbuktu. We hold Timbuktu. We hold Timbuktu. Mali. Yeah, that's fine. So, let's start reinforcing again. And then 
three racing and going on a raiding spree before the Shias are wiped out. Well, I could go for any religion, really, but I'd, I'd prefer a Muslim one for the immediate inheritance law. And yet. So, what are you up to, Byzantine Empire? You are defending... ...and... ...holy warring for Jerusalem. Oh, I see, you did take some of Jerusalem, but now you're holy warring Egypt for the rest. That is fine. Uh, chaste. Whatever, I already have children. Wow, we're suffering attrition. Well, it's fine. Let's go and raid. Could even split up and go and raid here. No, now we're just helping the Isli Emirate. There are going to be a resurgence of Shia here when the um, Timurids arrive. So I guess it wouldn't be too upsetting for the balance if the Shias disappeared from here. Um. <laughs> Throw him into the dungeon. Alright, light infantry. And nothing else. Darn it. No ladies. Guess we could go for a Sunni one as well. Because we do have some Sunni provinces. Would it be too weird? Right, this guy likes us, this guy doesn't. Ah, we got one, didn't we? Yes! Right then, well, uh, let's do uh, what we planned. Let's convert to Shia Islam. Our vassals, by the way. Who hates us? Who doesn't? This guy is in prison, so he doesn't even have a say. There we go. Now we are officially Shia. Demand, yes. Demand, yes. You... Demand. What title loss on succession? No, we're not losing anything, or are we? Oh, because he's not a Muslim. I see. Uh, might even do that and then demand his religious conversion. And hope that the rest still accept. Just make sure nothing stupid happens. Alright. Do I have any else? Anyone else in my... Oh man, our decadence is awful. Let the fast commence. Um, let's search for characters in our realm. My religion, no... Ruler, yes. Sort by opinion. <laughs> they all hate us. Excellent. Well, we need to make sure that... Oh, my wife. Uh, court musician. Oh, darn it. And I can't... Uh... Well, I can, actually. Seeing as I'm a Muslim, I cannot um, fire my religious guy, even though my religious guy is not of my religion. But there is a way to get rid of them. Send them to Finland! Ha! 
<laughs> yes. No. Not releasing the prisoners. That would be insane. And there we go. Um, my son. Yeah, why not? I need a spy master that likes me. Start converting. Aid Mubarak. So, my nephew. And someone else. Uh, my nephew again in prison. And my brother. Right, my brother is heir is all right, let's execute. And then his heir is this guy, execute him as well. My kinsman. Okay. Well, execute. Execute! Thank you! Now it's mine! That was my plan all along! So my domestic is too big! Can I fix it in some way? Can give away one county to someone. The worst county. Seems to be this one. Gurma. So let's give away Gurma to someone. Uh, let's invite some holy men. Salman, you are perfect. Uh, Gurma, there we go. And everything is excellent. And we have more retinues now. We can, in fact, free warrior retinue. Two of them, even. Uh, sure, whatever. Just so he will stop bothering me about it. All are equal in front of God. I am ex fully expecting a lot of revolts. Uh, West African revolts. But it's fine. Am I wounded already? No. Attempt to rescue them. Wounded will hopefully lead to scars. Diplomacy. Nice. I am humbled. Uh, humble is better than the rest. Time for heroic deeds. And, um, right. I'm hosting the tournament as well as going to Mecca at the same time. Got teleportation abilities. Alright, so Jerusalem is actually under Byzantine control. That's kind of awesome. Um, I wonder what the Arabians have to say about it. It's not their leader. This is. I am amazed that this guy is still hanging around here. Random Dutch guy in Beirut. By the way, wh wait, what? Wales? Wales inherited parts of England? What? A glass standing, even. What is happening? Alright, alright. So, we should probably look into um, taking land from the Sunnis here whenever we can. Perhaps reclaiming some land from Portugal as well, I don't know actually. Or we should, or we could just um, consolidate Mali for a little while, just so we know that we are not going to succumb to a random uh, West African revolt while we engage in warfare in other places. Mm -hmm. A chief caddy. 
So, that's the plan right now. For this episode, we're just going to wait and hope for um, conversion ticks and fight off any revolts. And then uh, we might fight for fight Maritziana for this. And then go for the Najibid, especially if the Najibids um, have a civil war uh, soon. I wonder if Portugal is going to holy war. No, they are defending against Caliph Hassan. Alright, invading Mauritiana. Also defending against the Emperor, against Emperor Andrew of Holy Roman Empire. <laughs> Andrew of Norfolk. Alright. There's some interesting situations here. I have to say that. Nope. No feats. I'm saddened by the fact that the uh, Zoroastrians or Mazdakis here converted to Islam. But it was bound to happen, I suppose. Wait, have the... Oh, the Ilkhanid have expanded into um, Suomenusko and Tengri lands here. The Tengris are reduced to just this little Ruthenia here. They have really been beaten hard. Oh, excuse me, I just ran over my microphone cord. Uh, anyway, it seems like some Muslims are infiltrating Moskva here. And uh, Perm, Khomeini, and Turkestan have their capitals right next to each other. Suomi, I think, is the only pagan with any authority left, having united all the Finnish Suomenusko tribes, except for Kostroma up here. Well, uh, Finnish and Lapish. Hmm. I do not know why it takes so long to convert. Because I believe the West African faith must have tanked in authority. West African, eight. Yeah, look at that, eight. That means it should... Well, perhaps it's because the Shia faith is really weak as well. It's only nine. Ah, that must be why it never converts. Yeah, yet. But still, we will increase the faith. Do we have any holy sites anywhere we could take? Why can I s not see the holy sites? Oh, this is... No, that's not a holy site. These are holy sites. Jerusalem... Alright, all of them are in the Arabian Peninsula. That's a problem. Oh well. Worst, ca worst case scenario is uh, we simply convert to Sunni. And there... Yep. Now we need to fight them, probably, for... Um... Oh, we can invade! Nice. So we will probably invade Moritziana in the next episode. And uh, take this and create a strong Mali. Move our capital up there. If so. Actually... It's kind of a nice capital. By the way, this is not Portugal anymore, this is Castile. And it's Castilian? What? No, it's supposed to be Welsh. Well, it's not going to last. If you look at this, you can see uh, all the vessels are still Welsh. So they are going to put a Welshman on the throne. The question is... No, actually, Castile might get some of this stuff here. Uh, well, n not that. Yes, that. That's Aragon being incorporated into Portugal. They have such similar colors that it's hard for me to tell. But it might... The borders might get messed up. Because Castile, when they split, they eventually will. Might get this. Yeah, still, interesting to see what's happening here in Spain. But I did not expect a, an actual Castilian to take the throne. That was seriously unexpected. Have we converted anything? No! My son died. No. 
And someone else died as well. Okay, okay. so my new heir is this guy. He is not the correct religion. I will have to imprison him. Demand. And then we invite a noble. You are fine. Then I'll grant you Ghana. And we could probably tr try and gamble for a better... Um, better guy to have as our court mullah. No. We'll just have to run with this guy. Alright. Alright. See? A civil war immediately. Uh, Count Mael's claim on Portugal. Duke Sinvalon. Yep. That was incredibly expected. Or do I still have any allies, by the way? No, they do not. Just the Duke of Galicia. <sighs> Seriously, Norway's drunk. Uh, Lithuania is giving the Teutonic Order even more provinces. They gave them Smolensk. Should be somewhere here, right? There it is. Alright, they're giving them a lot of stuff they've taken from Ruthenia. Yep, Ruthenia is... Yep, yeah, they're just diminishing. I wonder if the Ilkhanate will connect their lands. They might, actually. They're fighting for Bryansk. And then they might take Pronsk here. We'll have some random Nestorians up there. Hmm. Oh, are we gaining decadence? Yes, we are. From our son, right? Yes, our son. You can be... There we go. Now you won't earn any decadence anymore. That's right. Oh, can we form the Shia Caliphate? We need to be a Misra or Sai... No, we need to have piety of 1,000. Oh, we need to control Mecca and Medina, Jerusalem, Damascus and Baghdad. Okay. No, that's not going to happen. I think. I mean, it's not entirely impossible, but still. It seems like the Catholics are going to win Sicily. From uh, the Arabians. 20% in their favor. Alright, well, in the next episode, we'll probably invade northern Africa and take as much as we can. We will probably invade Mauritiana here from the Isli and then take Tangier while they are rebelling against Portugal. And uh, Hanyan and uh, then probably this. And if we're lucky, we might be able to attack the Arabians, because they are involved in the crusade and may be distracted by it. Anyway, I'll see you all in the next episode. Thank you for watching.